From August 3rd to August 10th, 2016, physicists from around the world have gathered in Chicago at the 38th International Conference on High Energy Physics, ICEP, to share the latest advancements in particle physics, astrophysics and accelerator science, and to discuss plans for major future facilities. At CERN, preparations work for this important biannual physics conference has been intense in the weeks preceding the event, with physicists from the LHC collaborations analyzing the extraordinary amount of data from the new high energy frontier of 13 tera electron volts reached by the LHC this year. At run two, we have doubled or close to doubled the energy of the collisions in, in the LHC and that gives us a lot more capability to look for new processes, new physics. And so with the uh, results that we are uh, reporting at this conference, we have more than 50 results which are based on the run two data that cover really a wide spectrum of the physics that we do at the Large Hadron Collider. We have gone through uh, what we call it a real marathon. <laughs> in terms of approving results to present to this conference, uh, we are, I think, uh, at the level of more than 70 new results compared to the last conference, of which there is uh, a good fraction, more than 50, which are concerning the data which we, we, which we have collected until the 15th of July. So you can understand that that has put uh, an enormous stress on the collaboration. We have observed one of the rarest decays of beauty hadrons ever seen. The decay of a, a neutral B0 into two charged kaons occurs less than one time in 10 to the million. And this has been searched for for many years and we have now seen it. Now finding such decays is much more than stamp collecting. It's vital to know the exact rate at which these ultra-suppressed processes occur, as this answer will help us better interpret several of our flagship measurements, ones which are very important in the search for physics beyond the standard model. So for us, the main uh, event uh, in the last year was uh, the heavy ion run, which every year more or less LHC uh, collides nuclei instead of protons uh, for about one month in December or November. And uh, in 2015, we had for the first time uh, heavy ion collisions at uh, an energy of 5 TeV. The conference also covered major highlights in neutrino physics and astrophysics and came to a close on Wednesday, August 10. Current data has not yet unlocked any new physics, however, the prospect of an ever-increasing data flow from the LHC continues to fuel the drive to understand how the universe ticks at the most fundamental level. <laughs>